Well, that's personal for Marvin Cotton Jr., who was wrongly convicted of murder at 21. Since he's been exonerated, he's made it his mission to advocate for those fighting to prove their innocence. It was important to really have a voice in the room um, because at a certain point in time, being an exoneree, you know, we were victims of the system. Martin Kahn Jr. spent 19 years in prison for a murder he did not commit because of a detective who withheld evidence and then pressured a jailhouse informant to testify with false information he later withdrew. We are living, breathing um, um, proof that the system failed, but we also are living, breathing proof that the system can work. It was the Conviction Integrity Unit in Wayne County that worked to free Cotton, and that's why he's lending his voice to other counties like Washtenaw and now Macomb as they work to create the same. Cotton met with Macomb County Prosecutor Pete Lacito, lawmakers, attorneys, and other advocates on Friday. Every chance we get, we try to go to as many different prosecutors as possible and kind of lay out what they're doing in Wayne County and hoping that they adopt it. By phone, Prosecutor Lucido tells me when he took office, he fought for funding for this unit, which is expected to start reopening and reinvestigating cases where people claim they are innocent by the end of January. Lucido, who touts his efforts on criminal reform, says it is estimated 2 to 5 percent of prisoners behind bars are wrongly convicted, and that's not acceptable. Like what happened to Cotton many times, false testimony comes from inmates looking for a deal or lighter sentence. There should be safeguards, and, and, and in past cases where this has happened, I think those cases should be really taking a look at, you know, um, um, through a microscope. Cotton, who has been a free man now for 15 months, holds no anger. Instead, he works as a motivational speaker and justice reform advocate while never taking anything for granted. I really enjoy all of the, the little moments, the things that you take for granted. Uh, when you lose everything, you really appreciate the littlest thing. You know, I pull over on the freeway sometimes just to see a, a sunrise or a sunset. And Prosecutor Lucido says they do plan to announce the new head of the Macomb County CI unit within the next couple of weeks.